fellas. Let's get them pumped. Like and subscribe. Real Murder TV. Okay, guys, I want to speak on KTS Vaughn. KTS Vaughn was one of the most talked about members over there when you talk about the ops to No Limit and Drench Game them at the time. Uh, you want to talk about people like KTS Vaughn. That's all the name you was hearing. You knew about... You knew the Dre had the, you know, Dre was the muscle back there, you know, and then you had Shooter Shells on the other side. You was, you was always hearing their name. You didn't hear people like Hell Real and all these other guys' name too much. KTS, Royer, and all of them. You seen them in the background. They was around from the beginning and stuff like that. But you know, Real G, you know, he popular because his brothers is big time. His brother, both his brothers fighting big time right now. Straight killers. Um, then they end up getting the real G. I know it's gonna probably be some stuff about that. I don't know if any get get back for that. You know, Spook. You know, uh, all them guys. Spook. They saying he, if Spook doing what he did, you know, they saying Spook really don't play no games, uh, and, and his numbers is up there. But KTS Vaughn was all you was hearing, like he was like the leader. But I don't know if he was the leader, but he was the one that everybody was hearing. When you say that name, you see him pull up, you pretty much better get scared. Um, you know when, when that time when him and his brother ran in on um, um, Cairo and them at the McDonald's and stuff, everybody always talking about that or whatever. But them boys were doing a lot too, man. They were terrorizing um, No Limit. No Limit them just stepped up and started putting boys in the grave. You know they behind it, you know. KTS um, locked, up, locked up for Mad Max. You know they black mob with KTS, one of them probably had something to do with Shooter Shells. I mean, uh, um, Lil Greg. So, Kobe, a lot of them guys, who knows what happened. But, you know, KTS Vaughn was feared, and people were scared of this guy. Every time you seen him, man, he just turned red. They say when he turned red, you better get the fuck up. Fuck up. When, he, when he turned red, you better get the fuck away from him. And you, especially your op. He got a video going viral when he smacked a female for merching on their guys. They asked her how she knew him or whatever, and then they didn't even care about all that. They just smacked her. I ain't saying that's a good thing, but, you know, these guys just don't care. KTS Vaughn used to be at night, walking around in the snow, looking for people, looking for ops. You out there, you know what I'm saying? They had videos walking and looking for ops. And you seen, the, you seen what happened to a, allegedly uh, Kobe and them. They was going, walked off and went to the bus or whatever and got killed. Um, a lot of them guys, man, but it's crazy, man. You got to be careful, man, because other guys be walking in them shadow. And them. that's why a lot of people come up dead, you know what I'm saying? When they end up bumping to them guys. Them guys, a lot of guys don't give you no pass, man. When they catch you in them alleys and stuff like that, they not going to give you a pass. They be lurking in them alleys. Then you end up walking past, and then you be like, damn. Uh, it was a lead that uh, M.O.B. Scrap was killed uh, walking past the alley. Uh, Boss Trail, was at, I think he was found in the alley. When he, um, It was a lot of people, man. I don't know. But, hey, KTS Vaughn, chill. <laughs>